So what we're going to show you today is the TI OMAP 3430 software development platform. So running on the platform will be WinMobile 6.5. We're going to start the demo by showing the onboard one NAND. And then we're going to show you the Micron single level cell NAND device with the Micron NAND software. And finally, we're going to show you the Micron FTL NAND software with a Micron multi-plane NAND device. What we have just done is we booted WinMobile 6.5 from one NAND on board the OMAP 3430 platform. What we're going to do is we're going to launch the test application. We go to the File Explorer bring up the performance 10 megabytes okay now we're going to run it one time okay and then you can see the performance results okay so as you can see the write speed is about 3.5 3.9 megabyte per second the read speed is about 10.92 megabyte per second the copy speed is about 1.7 megabyte per second the key point here you want to remember it write about 3 read about 10 So here we are, we just put it from the Micron single level cell NAND device with the Micron FTL NAND software. So we're do, going to do the same thing. We're going to go to File Explorer. We're going to run the same program, performance 10 megabytes. Now we're going to run the single cycle again. Again, we're going to run right a one megabyte a 10 megabyte file one time and so forth and do it with other sizes okay so as you can see the number become 5.13 megabyte per second for writing for reading is 25.03 and then for copying is 4.11 megabyte per second so remember the number before writing was about 3 reading was for about 10 so you can see already a significant improvement So what we have done now is we replace a SLC single plane micron NAND device with a dual plane micron NAND device and also write, running micron FTL software. So I'm going to go launch the same perform 10 test program. Okay, run one cycle. As you can see, the write performance significant increase. Now we go all the way up to 12.64 megabyte per second on writing. The read performance improved up to 26.32 megabyte per second, and copy goes all the way up to 4.4 megabyte per second. So if you compare that to the original one NAND result, it's an order of magnitude improvement, both on the read and the write. You virtually double the speed. So what this show is an average result, okay, come from several cycle of the testing. So as you can see, the first column represents the result from Samsung. The write speed 4.07. So when we apply Micron NAND device with a Micron NAND software, our number look better, 6.33 versus 4.07. So give you roughly 30% improvement, okay. But when we apply our dual plane device with the same software, our results went up to be three times better okay, on the right performance. That's very significant when you need to transfer large multimedia file. Okay? If you look at the read performance also improved 10 point, from 10.83 of one NAND to Micron software with single level NAND device to 23.48 and a dual plane give you further improvement of 26.25. And finally the copy performance went from Samsung 1.7 Micron SLC to 2.95 and then do plain SLC to 4.5. So the, the overall message is with Micron software and do plain device give you the best performance today. So we have cases that when customer already gone into the design cycle and they're willing to reevaluate the solution and look at the increased performance on both read, write, and copy.